Hello everybody and welcome to Sheltered, a game that's supposed to be like a post-apocalyptic survival where you live in a bunker, you build up resources, you have to go out hunting for stuff. Um, it seems like pretty good fun. I'm losing my voice as you can hear right now. Oh my god. <coughs> Sorry, that may happen a few times. But um, I'm going to try my best to enjoy this and if you guys like it, I can always continue. I might die. Custom so you start off with like a family. Okay. In Sheltered, you look after a family of two adults and two children. Before you begin, you can customize how each individual looks. They're set traits and also their stats that sounds pretty useful um traits and stats govern how the characters act uh for example a character with high strength is specially powerful in melee obviously so i guess accuracy would be like shooting all that kind of shit right click on that help character customer scene to see detailed explanation of stats and traits all right so we got gender male or fit we'll go male we'll name him um david he's got ginger hair he actually looks like david irl pretty much except he's got a collared shirt there Top colour. Oh man, okay, right. Bottom cut oh shit. No, what what colour does David wear? Um should we just make everything orange? <laughs> oh man, yeah, let's do that. Oh Is that naked? No, that's just grey. Okay. We'll make everything orange. There we go. Where oh, do I have a choice of orange? That's close to orange. Skin colour. Oh, opposite of that. Super pale. Actually no, he's kinda of tanned. Hair colour, leave it at that. Head type, fine. Legs. Oh, I definitely got to wear the shorts. <laughs> Traits, okay. Deep sleeper. That sounds like David. The other day I tried to get him out to record and he slept through the whole thing. Proactive, hands on, no. Optimistic, no. Um, resourceful, not really. Hygienic, definitely not. Small eater, no. Courageous, maybe. Deep, deep sleeper seems like the, the realistic, realistic trait for him. Oh, he's troubled. Um, stat preset. Okay, street smart, logical. Oh, I can't actually. I can. I can't actually choose that. Okay. Um, so we've got intellect. He's not logical. We've got well-rounded. A bit of everything. Okay, that seems like kind of fair. But let's see what other ones there are. Violence. Ooh, intelligence, charisma, perception, dexterity, strength. This seems more like a David. Um, <laughs> charisma skill of one. <laughs> He's not gonna like me for this. But okay, violent seems like a good David one to go. All right, next. Um, let's do Carla, my girlfriend. Well, the, firstly, her skin color is completely wrong. Okay, there we go. Her hair color needs to be blonde. All right. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Gender female. Bottom color. We can actually have two males, but whatever. Bottom color. She can have some hot pants on. All right, let's just get some. There we go. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, for some reason, you can't change the top type. It's just, it's just wrecked. Okay. Fuck it, that'll do. I honestly don't. She's also a deep sleeper. That is literally like, she's pretty troubled. God, that's pretty bad. No, um, she is actually a deep sleeper. All she does is fucking. But she's also hands on. That's that's a trait that she has. She does um a lot of hands on work. She looks after uh, sick people in their homes. All right, stats preset. So you can't actually choose this. Is you have to just go for a stat preset. So we'll go for, um, I think. Oh, good upbringing. Intelligence, charisma, perception, dexterity, strength. Well-educated. 11. Uh, no, I think she's more of... Oh, athletic. Intelligent, strength and dexterity, perception. Um, I think I think I'm going to go for a well-rounded here. Um, okay, next. Oh, we've got a little kid now. All right. Um, duh, look at him. Okay, he can be called shit brains. I've just given up on the names already. Shit brains, the little twat of a child. Why is he wearing a hat? All right, we're gonna we're just gonna skip through this guy. He can be optimistic. He's an optimistic little kid. Kids are always optimistic. He's a brain box, sure. He's a little kid. Yeah, let's go for that. Next, and Amanda. Oh, okay. We'll have some ethnic diversity here. Sure, that sounds good to me. Um, is Amanda a good? Um, I don't. I can't think of another name right now. A bully. Oh man. Okay. No, she's not gonna be bullied. Alert. Um, smarty pants, know it all, rough and tumble. So she's a she can be an aggressive little, sh well spoken. Yeah, let's give her a well spoken. We need someone who's kind of smart. All right. Oh god, we get a pet. Family name. Um. Oh god. Um. The Muck Millens. I don't know why. Pet's name. Oh, we get we get a horse. We can have a dog, a cat. A fish tank. Oh, hang on. So the snake has the ability to keep rats away. Oh, they've got uses. Okay. Okay. Um, 
Whilst the snake is out of its very own, no rats will come to the shelter, even whilst it's dirty. Okay. Beware its bite. All right. A majestic and beautiful horse, capable of carrying items in the saddlebag, requires three por uh, portions of food a day. Don't forget to build a stable. Shit, that needs a lot of food. All right, we're going to go for a cat. Um, excellent at killing rats. All right, and I guess the cat lives off rats. Um, kills will be transferred into a freezer. Provides a small stress reduction to all family members. Oh, I love cats. All right, we're going to call it the name of my cat. There we go. There we go. Mitzi. It's definitely going to die. Um, Alright, next. I've got too much attachment to this. Do you want to play the tutorial? Yes, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Alright. Okay, this seems like fun. Apparently, it's quite easy to just get wrecked in this game. So, this should be interesting. Um, it's one of these games that I think I might do a series out of. Because it seems like quite a lot of fun. It depends how balanced it is and how well it works. But I'm not one to care too much about graphics. I care more about enjoying the game. Um, oh, paused. Okay. Oh, and there's all sorts of stuff. So, uh, settings. I just wanted to turn the... The music down a little bit because it was kind of loud for me but anyway so we've got feeling okay so how do we control there's no tutorial oh okay oh no we're just entering the shelter okay i guess this is the shelter for now do we upgrade shit and stuff take a good look at your surroundings oh okay look around the shelter by moving the cursor to the edge of the screen okay um zoom in with zoom in, in that and out of left control okay and we can use oh Add a fuel generator to restore power. Okay. All right. So you have to gradually upgrade this bunker. There's a car out there. Okay. Um, generator. Integrity 30%. Daily use 0 point fuel. Fuel generation. Uh, okay. So I click the coinage. How do I build a generator? So highlight an object and press the right mouse to interact with it. Okay. Add fuel. Right. So there's no fuel in it. Oh, okay. So we've got a generator, but there's no fuel. So the fuel comes from up here. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. So he's putting fuel in it. We can zoom in with a uh, middle click. Okay, not middle click. There we go. So our bunker's pretty small right now, actually. But I guess it goes down. Um, commands will be formed by the currently selected value member shown at the top left of the screen. Okay. Um, the generator must be... Oh, spread the work across your family to avoid tiring. Oh, shit. I've got these stats. Look at this. Thirst, hunger, tiredness, toilet, um, dirtiness, stress, trauma. Um... Okay, impress the QD to so Carla. What's Carla gotta do? Fix the generator. To be fair, she's probably quite good at that. And keep it from breaking. Alright. So right click fix. Okay, so there's different tasks. Okay. Fix the generator. So I can speed it up as well if I want to. Until she's doing it. Super quick. So can I move these dudes around or they just do nothing? I guess this icon will appear over items that need a repair. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. Is it fixed? It's fixed. Okay. Select David. Uh, drink from the water butt. Is he thirsty? Where is he? Oh, it's getting red. Okay, yeah. Drink water. Go, you pleb. Oh, shit. So, yeah, he's got an alarm signal over his head. You're all thirsty, bro. Man, these graphics are kind of weird. They're, like, very... I don't know. Right, your goal is to survive for as long as possible. You can explore, expand, maintain your shelter, and keep the family healthy um, to help achieve this. Explore and gather resources using the radio transmitter to set up an expedition. Expand the shelter and build new items with the workbench. Um, your next step might be to explore to build uh, or check on your family. How you survive is up to you. Okay, so there's probably some strategies here. So we have a freeze... A hazmat suits. Oh, shit. Oh, hang on. So we can get him to move. So we can get him to view this. What the hell is this? A journal. Day one. So it begins. Blah, blah, blah. Quests. There are no current quests. Okay. Um, so what's down here? It's all these right. Let's, so we've got David selected. What can we do? Radio transmitter. Um, we can intercoms. I guess with the doors. Can we shut the doors? Uh, shelter door. Okay. Um, what else can we do? Um, oh, hang on. This is a tiny pantry. Oh, the workbench is down here. All right, workbench. Right click. Craft an item. All right, building and upgrading. Building new systems and upgrading is important. Okay, yeah, yeah. You can find items in the wasteland and use them to upgrade to create new items here. You can also expand your shelter by crafting new rooms in the workbench. Okay, so we can make... Oh, man, there's all kinds of stuff we can make. We can make a snare trap. Um, this is tried and tested and trap useful for catching wildlife. Harvest ensnared animals to store them as rations. So we rope for that. Um, a shelter room. A large concrete room uh, used in the expansion of the shelter. All right, so it uses two cement... Two wood and twenty oh and two metal. Okay. Oh, it's not expensive to build an extra room. Um what the hell is this? Cement. Oh, we need to make cement, which needs sand. 
But we already have cement. Okay. Only only two though. Right. So to make more cement, we need sand. Right. This is a sleeping bag. Do we have any of those? Is there anywhere we can sleep right now? There isn't, is there? Shit. Okay. I should probably do that. All right. Craft it. Oh fuck! Where did the cat go? Oh, did I just punch one of? Them? No, Carla, go and um, craft an item. Let's build a sleeping bag. Boom. So I can put this down somewhere. I guess anywhere. Let's put it down like here. Oh, there we go. Boom. Assigning jobs. You've assigned your shelter member a job. Jobs appear next to the selected member's portrait, and you can have a maximum of two jobs in the queue. All right. Jobs include such as fixing, repairing, crafting, eating, drinking, sharing, and sleeping. You can cancel a job by pressing C or clicking the X. Alright, so we've got one sleeping bag, so if someone's tired, particularly tired, um, so she's building this. David, what are you doing? Are you tired? He's not particularly tired. Is the children tired? Nah. Alright. Oh, there's a deer! How do I... How does I kill deer? I don't think I can. Okay. Oh, I got a handyman. You can move most of the objects around your shelter by going to the workbench selecting rearrange. You can also expand your shelter by crafting new rooms in the workbench. Maybe I should make one new room because it seems a little bit. Well, actually, a lot, there's not a lot of stuff in here. Right. Um, she's feeling okay. They're all feeling okay right now, right? Craft. Um. Uh, craft an item. What? Right. So, what tier two items are there? Um. Oh, we require a workbench tier two. Okay, shit. So this is uh, an incinerator. Handy device allows you to destroy any excess items from your inventory and gain fuel. Tiny pantry. Uh, it's capable of storing twenty rations. Um, that sounds like a makeshift shower. We probably need all this sort of stuff. I'm thinking I'm going to build a room, though. So we're going to build another room, and we're going to put, like, a shower down here. I think. There you go. So go and build that room, you son of a bitch. Okay, so he's building a room. So she can also... Oh, it looks like we have the parts to upgrade a system. Oh, we've got a tiny pantry here. Okay, so maybe we can upgrade. Right, she's telling him we can upgrade, right. Oh, he's in... He's in this... He's vanished. David's vanished into a wall. Right. Uh, so we'll upgrade... Ah, you can increase your shelter's efficiency by upgrading your oxygen filter, generator, and water filter. These shelter's doors can also be upgraded to help shelter against breaches. Okay, so we can upgrade something. So we can upgrade our workbench to tier... So upgrades the workbench to tier 2. Okay, but we don't have the stuff for it. We need 7 hinges and 7 rope. So I guess we have to go out and explore to get that stuff. So tier 2... Alright, so we've got... T oh no, we can upgrade to tier 2 and then tier 3. And then okay, so we'll upgrade to tier 2. Alright, twenty plastic, 5 plastic, 10 nails, and 5 wood. Sure, so we'll upgrade that, and it means we can build tier 2 items also. Um, kiddies, how are they doing? Not very hungry. So I think the lower they are, the not... the not, Oh, a shelter member is tired and needs to sleep. Um, tired is from taking part in activities that gain experience, and they will let you know if they're tired. Um, you can craft an object workbench to... Okay, yeah, I've got, I've got that. So who's tired? Who is tired? Who is tired? I don't know. I can hear lots of noise. So nobody's thirsty. Some oh, this one's getting quite hungry, right? Eat food. There you go. Little shit brains, eat your food. Do they grow up into adults or do we lose if they die? I don't know. Shit brains is eating a can of food. Lovely. Feeling hungry. Right, I think I just fixed that because I just ate some food. Um, Carla's getting getting there. Oh, David is tired. David McMillan. If you want to speed up time, you yeah, okay, sure. Gotcha. Alright, so I can speed up time. Boom. Dig that hole. Oh, okay. He's very tired. Very tired. Can I get him to... Oh, shit. His tiredness is pretty bad. Okay. Stop digging. Okay, go to bed. David, you plum. Sleep. There you go. Okay, so she can carry on with the task, I guess. Resume. Ah, okay, cool. So she can carry on digging. The kids don't do shit. Um... What are the kids good for? So I've got their stats and that. I think they're good for like challenges and things. Oh, so that's rubbish. Stressed out. Oh no, a shelter member seems to be a little stressed. This occurs when their basic needs. All right, it's probably David. Um, is it David? No. Is it Carla? No. Who's stressed out? Oh, stressed. Yeah, a little bit stressed. Okay. She's very sleepy as well. I might need to put another sleeping bag. Can the kids build stuff? Let's see. Craft item. Oh, they can. Okay. So these they can craft another sleeping bag. So we can't build like. Oh, we can do tier two stuff now. A bookshelf <coughs> for reading provides stress relief for grown-ups. A small pantry capable of storing 30 items. All right. Um, so can we build a, uh, an actual bed? Um, the single bed of uh, moderate night's sleep, but can be sleeping better on the floor. 
Um, reduces tiredness. Okay, so it needs three springs, six wool, three wood, and six... Yeah, we'll build a fucking bed. We're going to put a shower somewhere as well. We need more space. Okay, we can put a bed here. There we go. We're going to put a bed there. The kid's going to build the bed. And she, can, she needs to go to sleep afterwards. Um, this little kitty can build a fucking shower. Because why not? Um, so we can probably build a decent-ish shower, right? What's this? A bulletproof vet? Man, there's a lot of items in this game. A light. Um, so we'll get some basic, some paint to colour it. Nice. Um, I guess they probably increases. Uh, probably the most popular colour in advertising. Okay. Pole stove. Um, a barely functioning stove will heat up your rations to a small degree. Makes uh, food satisfy hunger a little bit more. Uh, that oh, we need. We need a hinge for that. The fuck do we get hinges? Can we craft hinges? Um, in tier one, maybe I don't know. Um, a makeshift recycler. Okay, this is interesting. Circuit boards. With this recycling machine, you can break down items in their base parts. The recycler is not very efficient, wasting a good amount of material in the process. Okay, so we can also build a prospector's kit. Oh my God. Um, Items in mine clearings, mountain passes, and caves. Oh my god, there's lots of shit. Fire extinguisher. It's all kinds of stuff. But we can't really build any of it. Right, specials, nothing yet. There's a lot of items, actually. Look at them all. So, we've built a bed. I wanted to build a, sh a basic shower, I guess. Um, a makeshift shower can go here. So they can get a nice shower in. Right, so that kid can build that. Hurry up and build the bed, you lazy shitbags. Alright, so two beds should hopefully be enough. Oh, thirsty. She's thirsty. This kid is doing all right. Um, Ship Brains is actually doing okay. All right, she can go to sleep. Sleep. So she'll get um, much better sleep here. Ship Brains. So what is in this hazmat suit? So you can put on a hazmat suit. You can look at the radio. Oh, what's this? Clipboard. Open clipboard. Uh, integrity report. Oh, nice. It shows you the integrity of all stuff. So the water filter is 38%. Oh, I should probably go and fix that. Uh, all right, Ship Brains. Go and fix the water filter. Hopefully you don't die. All right, fix it. That's good that these kids can actually do stuff. I didn't think... Oh, there's a shelter... Ha what the hell is this? Oh, no. No, fix it. There's a shelter hatch. Right, of course. Hey, wait. Go on surface that hazard suit can cause hazardous health. Remember to put one on... Oh, shit. Okay. Take suit. Shit, get back inside. Take the suit. Go inside. I didn't realise that... Okay, fuck. Trauma, stress... Oh, we got to day two without dying. Oh, they need to oh shit. We don't have a toilet. Oh, this kid needs to sleep now. Well, we'll build a... Um... Oh, shit, she can build a toilet. Okay, craft item. I didn't think about a toilet. Uh, a bucket toilet. That's got to be better than that, right? That we can do. Oh, no. Um, also, where the fuck's our cat gone? More to the point. Um, oh, it's a hiding spot? It's supposed to hide when shelter's been breached. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh, all right, I guess we're going to use a toilet bucket. There you go. Right next to the shower. Uh, okay, he's got his hazmat suit on. Alright, go and fix. Alright, because that's getting damaged and we want our water filter because we'll dive. So, can, uh, water 14 out of 13. A medium water bar. Okay, so we can upgrade this shit as well. Now, David is hungry. But he's not that tired. Okay, eat some food, you plum. Alright, cancel sleeping. Alright, this is kind of like The Sims in a way. I like this. Rain on surface. Is that good? Do we get more water from that? Um, oh, there's a rabbit. Look at that. So can we hunt any of There's a camper van as well. I might get him to explore that. Okay, so we've got hazmat suits. That's pretty cool. Um, I guess we can only use two at once because there seems to be only two. So he's eating away. Carla is sleeping away. She's not so tired now, but she's quite hungry. Um, right, eat food from the pantry. Right, let's, let's try and upgrade some stuff and then we'll go out and then explore. So, oh, getting thirsty. All right, who's thirsty? Oh, this little girl's really, really tired and really thirsty. Right, drink and then go to sleep. And then sleep. Okay. Cool. This ship brains actually, in order to survive, you'll need to upgrade your shelter system by gathering parts and resources. The best way to do this is to set up an expedition. Alright, I'll set up an expedition then. I guess that's what people want to see me dying. Oh, this is our items. Okay, so we've got seven fuel, thirty water, eight food, and a hundred percent oxygen. Okay, so it's like our base stuff. It'd be cool if I had a breakdown of all the items we got, but I guess you have to look in the earth. Uh, where is the fucking cat? More to the point. Just gone. Um, but at least we have a shower now. So she's asleep. David is kind of dirty. Take a shower. There we go. Might as well. This kid is tired. Shit brains is tired. All right. Carla's almost woken up. Oh, she has woken up. Okay, shit brains can go to sleep afterwards. So stuff loses integrity over time. Okay, well, he's fixing it pretty good. 
So she's eating now, and then she needs a toilet. Take a dump right next to me, uh, David, using the shower. That's really weird, actually, saying that. <laughs> there you go, she's taking a dump. All right. Oh, God, this is pretty gross, isn't it? And David's just like, what the fuck are you doing, woman? This is disgusting. <laughs> um, all right. Let's set up an expedition. Oh, we can scan frequencies. What does this do? We're going to listen to the radio. All right. Um, when nature calls, look, somebody needs a toilet. If family members relieve themselves when required. They may end up having accidents. Okay. Well, I think I've relieved. Oh, she needs a loo. Wait, wait, wait. No, don't go to sleep yet, kids. Use the toilet first. I have to wash. Oh shit! Right, you have to wash it out. Ah, oh, ugh. No, not. I didn't mean you to do it. Fuck it, he can do it. He's really tired as well. Um, right, what can you build, Carla? Let's have a look. So, craft an item. So we can build a metal ladder to move between layers. A small water bar. A grave. Oh god. Mop and bucket. Okay. A, uh, a gas mask. Um. A quick bucket that protects the wearer from radiation whilst exploring. One use only. Okay, it's pretty cheap though. Um, so we've got a small pantry, which we already do. Uh, a bedroll. So if an expedition party has a bedroll equipped, their status will be increased 25% slower whilst on their expedition. Okay, but does it mean they can sleep? Um, Tripwire. Oh, fucking hell. To arm inside the... God, there's traps. There's all kinds of shit. Oh, a paint trap, right. Bandages. Oh, we don't need them yet. Actually, you might want to take them on an expedition, right? We'll make some bandages. Why not? So, is she leveling up? Can I see her, like, stats? Um, automated shelter members will take care of their own hunger, uh, toilet tiredness, and hygiene needs. Press H or home to switch um, on and off. Okay, so we can automate them if I want. Right, so that was automated. Oh, I've got 10 XPs. Not that I know what that does. I'm exhausted. All right, he's cleaned it out. Use the toilet, you little shit brains. Use toilet, and then go to bed. All right, and then the two adults can go out on a quest. Um, although David's still just listening to the radio like a nut job. All right, what else can we build? Tool efficiency zero. Crafting that. Can we build any tools right now? I oh, can we build a first aid kit. That's probably a good idea, right? Build a first aid kit. Um, some more XPs. Oh, shit. What the fuck is happening? Oh, he's going to the toilet, I think. But he's just really fucking tired. Wait, is he... Okay, he's, yeah, you know, he's gone for the toilet. Alright, and then... Carl is on cleaning duty. 10 XP again, right, nice. Oh, there's a cat, right? I, was, I thought it was a giant poo. <laughs> it's just a cat. Nice. Okay, so the cat will catch rats. Alright. Nice. Oh, she needs a shower as well, and then she can take a shower. Sure. David's just listening to the radio like a nutter. Um, it's kind of thirsty. Alright, and then we'll, ex we'll do an expedition after this, right? And then you can drink water. Alright, speed this shit up while these guys are sleeping. Water storage at max capacity. Okay. Probably because we upgraded it. Oh, scanning radio frequency not yield any information. Brilliant. Ugh. And now David's tired again, for God's sake. Look at him with his fucking short shorts on. Alright, David can then uh, sleep. Cancel that. He can sleep. Did he have... Did he take... Oh, he took a drink. Okay, sleep. Alright, Carla's pretty okay. She needs a toilet. But then, okay. Okay. Okay, Amanda and Carla. Right, um, Carla, let's go and fucking set up an expedition. Assemble your party. Gun expedition allows shelter members to search the wastelands for items, resources, and recruit other wasteland survivors to your shelter. Um, you can have as many uh, concurrent expeditions as you like, but maximum is party size is two. So you can have two parties of like two or three parties of two. Feeling okay. Sleeping in sleeper bag. He's tired though. Um, so it's going to send her. She's kind of thirsty. Okay. Boom. Wait, what? Oh, okay, right, okay. And the little girl, sure. Map. Oh, you can plot exactly where your party will travel to by adding waypoints. Expedition costs water. The longer the expedition goes, the more water is required. We've got full up on water right now, so. Um, water required 0 out of 30, so. Oh, shit. There's a small farm, there's a church, there's an unknown, there's a small house. Right, we're kind of low on food. There's unknown. Oh god, this 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 is cool. Okay, hold drag and right mouse button to you or use arrow keys to move the map. All right, um, right mouse button. Add waypoint. All right, we'll go to there. Oh shit. Okay, and then the church. All right, conf I didn't. Right, remove that one. Want to go to the? There we go. Right. What about there? Nine. Okay, we can go to those. Confirm. 
Right, preparation is the key to successful exhibition. You may want to take items to trade other, such as weapons or times when your physical welfare is under threat. Um, right, let's go for a fucking attack. Remember, gas masks to each party, otherwise they may become quite ill. Oh shit, we've got gas masks already. Okay. I didn't even know where the storage area is, but fine, we'll equip a gas mask to party. Oh no. Um, equip. Okay. Um, what's this? A nail. Um, should we take some petrol with We'll take a first aid kit with us. We shall take... Um, uh, Anti-radiation tablets. Sure, we'll take some of those. I don't want all of them. There we go. I can take one at a time. Alright. Plastic. Nah. A bucket. Nah. A valve. No. Metal. No. Um... Okay, who else? What else can give them? Uh, rubber, plastic. So I've, only, I've got one first aid kit. So water has already been equipped. Um, food rations, sustenance to combat hunger. I just take some food with me, right? I take like three food. Um, we haven't got a lot of stuff. An empty petrol can. We'll take that with us as well. Um, other than that, there's not a lot we can. Do. A pipe. Okay, we can equip this. All right. Sure. Um, equip. Wood, uh, material. So, what, how do I? Okay, that's instead of a uh, pipe. Seems like a better weapon, right? Okay, confirm for her anyway. Amanda can also have a pipe. All right, this is this is not the greatest, but it's fine. So these have one-time uses, and then they're done. They're spent. Um, okay, so there's not a lot else we should worth taking. So we've got petrol cans that are filled up, filled up, filled up. Lens. We've got a bunch of random crap, basically. Let's get some more random crap, right? Send the party. Yes. So we get to, like, see them go, I think. And then the rest of these dudes will, uh... They're gone. Oh, they didn't They didn't put on hazmat suits. Oh, they're just, oh, they're just gone, gone. Oh, do you copy? Someone's trying to get in touch with the radio transmitter. An icon. Okay. It's important to answer transmission to communicate with family members who are on expeditions. Shit. Get out of bed! Shit brains. He still hasn't... He still hasn't taken his hazmat suit off. Um... Searching locations is the best way to acquire items and resources. Uh, these will differ in variety and amounts, um, depending on the type of location. You may also encounter other wasteland survivors in locations, so always be prepared. All right. Hello, this is Amanda. We've found that a church out in the wasteland. Should we check it out? Search location. Take off your hazmat suit, you little plum. Right. Return hazmat suit. They didn't take those out with them. They should have done. That was a mistake. Um, right. Ship brains needs a shower as well. David's in bed. David's looking after shit brains. Take shower. All right. He's also kind of thirsty, right? So David's... I keep keep doing that instead of selecting a different character. There we go. David is sleeping. Oh, radio. Quickly. Accept transmission. Get up. Um, Carla to base. We found someone in this church. They're signaling to us. I think they want to talk to us. What should we do? Um, get involved. So that means we think we jump to this situation. Oh, God. Here we go. There's someone out here by the church. Uh, not seen many others out here recently. Okay. Confirm. <laughs> what? Okay. Hi. Not surprising, is it? Um, it's been a good while since any I messed anyone up good. Oh, shit. And you think you're going to get a chance now? Fuck. Uh. Oh, no. Oh, God. Walk. Okay, we just left them. Okay, fuck. We, they wanted to fight us. Um, but they don't have the best strength stats, so that's probably not the greatest idea. Okay. There was another one. Fuck. Answer. I found a small farm out in the wasteland. Yes, keep, keep searching. I told you to go there, for God's sake. Alright, so we get... Res okay, so we need to respond to them quickly, otherwise they may die. Um, okay, David needs a toilet, kind of. Not really. Uh, Alright, what should we do? Let's... I don't know what to craft right now. Let's go and... Can we... Let's put on a hazmat suit. Take a suit. Oh, income range. Accept transmission. Um, we found this small farmer. Uh, are you interested? Examine items. Right, you can transfer items you find in this wasteland. Okay, nice. We actually found some stuff. Also discard carried items by swapping them out. So we can take some anti-radiation tablets. I want those. An empty petrol can is fine. First aid kit's nice. And some food. Confirm. So we've got... We don't have a lot of space. 16, oh no, we've got 16 out of 50 space. That's fine. 
Um, confirm. And we've got some rope as well. Nice. Yes. Okay, cool. So we've got some items. Um, Dave's putting a hazmat suit on. He's going to check out the... Uh... Oh, shit. We can upgrade this thing. We're going to check out the van. Uh, a sturdy set of wheels. Uh, oh, I should have just... Okay, fine. Once you have found all the parts of the RV, you can choose to use it in expeditions. Oh, shit, so we need an alternator, two tires... Oh, we need a load of fucking stuff. That isn't going to happen. Put your seat away. <laughs> um, all right, so what's shit brains doing right now? He's thirsty. Take a drink. How much water have we got? 21. We've got loads of water. Um, medicine cabinet. We've got some anti-radiation and some bandages. So where's actual storage, then? Where's our basic storage? Is it small crate? Oh, okay, right. So this is where I store all our stuff. I see. Got it. Okay, well, we'll wait for this expedition to get back. But they might... Oh, there's the right... Fuck. Accept transmission. We found a small house. Search the location. What are they going to find? What are they going to find? Who knows? This is quite cool. So can we... I guess we can expand this bunker quite a lot. They're just sort of milling around. I don't really know what to do. I can hear my cat. Mitzi... I can't select the cat, but he's his health is seven. Oh, he's starving. How do I feed the cat? Can I fix the cat? No. Get out of the way. I want to. Oh, hang on. Accept transmission quickly. Uh, we stumbled across somebody in the small house. Sure, I approached them. There's no fun without. But that's just one dude. Hey, who's that? That's all I can do. Confirm. There we go. Oh, um, recruit. I don't think it's too safe around here. Do you want to join us? New recruit. Yay. Um, they can be given jobs, but automation can, can, cannot be switched off and they cannot be sent out on expeditions until their loyalty is high enough. Okay. Um, loyalty increases over time, but if the recruit becomes fully stressed, they will leave the shelter. Automation can be deactivated after three days. Okay. And sent on expeditions after five and they'll be fully loyal after a week. Got it. Okay, good, well-managed teams. People like me. Futures for hours for the taking. All right, recruits. He's got not great stats, but another person can't hurt, right? Actually, his stats are pretty shit. They're fucking terrible. We're going to keep them anyway. Just for the funsies. All right, welcome to the group. Okay, sure. So, oh, Carla gained some uh, intellect from that. Nice. Okay, cool. So we're just there with fucking pipe. We should have just beaten the shit out of him, to be honest. Taking all his stuff. Um, accept transmission. So examine the items in the house. Small house. Okay, right. Did I did I transfer the stuff the wrong way? Oh fuck. Yeah, I know what I just did. Um. Yeah, guys. In the last uh, in the last house, I transferred all the stuff the wrong way, didn't I? So I put all my stuff in a chest and just walked away and left it there. Fuck! <laughs> oh no! This disastrous. There was loads of weird shit. Ah. Oh. That that's pretty bad, isn't it? I did it. Why is it that way round? That's so wrong. Ah oh, fuck. Well, on that note, guys. Oh, they're back now, anyway. On that note, we're gonna leave it there. And if you want me to carry on with this, even if I fucked that up, I'll. Ca I just gave all my. I just left my items in a fucking hole. Uh, oh, this is a recruit. Anyway, I'll catch you next time if you want me to. Um, for now, bye-bye.